Welcome back to Suvida Everything, guys. Today, the poor man's tomahawk. Check it out. We all love that presentation of a beautiful tomahawk steak. And when you cut it open, there's nothing better. But since it is a little pricey, today I'm gonna show you how to make a poor man's version. Let's do it. For today's cook, I'm using this beautiful three bone short rib. And the first thing we need to do is transform this beautiful piece of meat into tomahawk. And here's how. Now that we got these beautiful tomahawks ready, it's time to sear them. Let's do it. Since one of the butcher's twine got ripped up, we just gotta retie it, no big deal. And for my rub, here's what I got. Remember, exact amount in the description down below. Garlic powder, cayenne pepper, granulated onion, mesquite grill seasoning, chili powder. Finish it off with smoked paprika and our rub is done. Then I just season it with salt, pepper and our rub. And also for the first time, I'm trying out one pot vegetable side dish. Check it out. I started off with roasted corn, salt, black pepper, parsley, a little bit of butter, just a little bit. And finish it off with Parmesan cheese. I'm gonna be cooking these beautiful short rig tomahawk at 185 degrees Fahrenheit for 14 hours. We got the tomahawks ready to go. Let me show you something. Check it out, everybody. I have this awesome container with the lid and it becomes quite hot and the heat is enough to transfer it to my uh, corns over here. Check it out. This, ooh, it is hot. Ooh, should be delicious. But let me tell you, the short rib, they float and they float a lot. So I had to put something on top to, to make sure that that doesn't happen. But enough talking, it's time, it's ready, let's do it, check it out. My good friend Ninja, what do you think, bro? Man, I love it, bro. I call this one the poor man's tomahawk, yeah? You just got a piece of meat and put it on the bone? That... <laughs> kind of like that, yes. <laughs> wow. All right. Ninja? Ninja is stealing it. Come on, bro. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hold on. You're supposed to wait. You're not supposed to film this, bro. <laughs> Man! Ninja, are you ready to try this? Go for it, Ninja. Give me your honest opinion. Yeah. We already know. Wow. Mm. Mm. I, I love Costella. Costella means short ribs. Short ribs. Mm -hmm. This thing is awesome, bro. This is the tenderest thing you can ever eat. Let me try the corn. Mm. Oh, yeah. How's the coin? I like it. Toasted. Mama, I gotta cut one for you. I'm gonna give you the honors. Mama's gonna go caveman style, Mama. Look at that. Ooh, ooh, hold on. Whoa, it's falling apart, Mama. Oh, Mama, I don't have to handle this thing. <laughs> That's how to do it. Wow, whoa. Super, 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 super 
tender. It's a very beefy flavor, still juicy. The searing outside gives you a nice uh, texture to it. Basically melt in your mouth. And overall? Uh, overall, delicious. Was it tender, mama? Was it oh, juicy? Yeah. It's oh, juicy, it's yeah. tender, it's flavorful, it's awesome. All right, my turn again. Uh. <laughs> oh. oh, it's gonna fall apart. Ooh, I like that texture. It is melt in your mouth. Very well seasoned. That rub is fantastic, everybody. Whoa, extremely flavorful, very beefy. Braising it inside of the bag, guys, is fantastic. However, make sure you put something on top of it because it's gonna float like a boat. I'm selling some anchors there for boats. If you need something, let me know. How much is your anchor, Ninja? We wanna know. 25 pounds. That thing will never float. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try that corn. Pretty good. It is fantastic. I enjoy it very much so. I think it's a great idea to be doing dishes inside of the pot like this. I will come out with a few more so we can give it a try and let you guys know if it's good or not. If you enjoyed this video, everybody, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, be sure to subscribe for future videos. And remember, if you're interested in anything I use, everything is in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. Love you. We out.